I had uh, friends in, in uh, Piedmont, South Dakota, that had a little home up here on the Yarnell Hill, and uh, they invited me down once to come down to this area, you know, in the winter, so I did. And um, at that time, it was, I think it was about 1973, and uh, I got a little motel in town, right in town here, down the hill, and it was th uh, about three dollars a a, a, no, it's a three dollars a day, right? And I kind of fell in love with this town, and I could walk around and sketch. I had no car, but I'd walk. I walked all the way to the Congress Mine once because there were buildings there, and sketched. Well, uh, that went on a couple of years. I would save my money, come down to Congress, then I was coming on a bus, and take the three dollar a day motel room, and sketch. And uh, one year, the owner of the motel announced that I had to move out. There was, uh, he had uh, promised a sheep herder, a sheep uh, herder coming in, that he could have, he was supposed to get that motel. And um, I think the year was about 1979. And uh, I didn't want to leave Congress, and uh, at that time, uh, Belle Deck and her son Tom were developing this area, having lots for sale. So I had saved a thousand dollars, and <clears throat> all you needed was a thousand dollar down and payments of eighty-eight dollars a month, and you could buy a lot here. And this lot was uh, six thousand dollars. So uh, I thought, well, I didn't have a house here, but I'd put a tent up. You know, I didn't want to leave town. <laughs> so I did buy the lot. Everything went through fine. And this I was the first person in this whole area, this whole development, to buy a lot here. I had a piece of, piece of land, <clears throat> but the, and the sheep herder never did show up, so I still got to stay. Then the next year, my son came down, and he started to build here on this little piece of land that I was paying for. And at that time, there was nothing here, not a tree anywhere, nothing. It was pretty. It was pretty rough. And he came down with his wife alone, and started before I arrived because I was still working at the uh, information center out there. But that's how I got to Congress.